Widespread and Lasting Living Style Reform. One Community Weekly Progress Update number 103. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our weekly progress update number 103, February 20th, 2015 edition. As always, I'll be covering with pictures and video all of our team's progress and accomplishments for the last week. And if you'd like more details, more specifics, links to all the open source content, tools, tutorials, resources, everything that our team is creating, you can visit our written blog. Last but not least, if you'd like to be added to our newsletter list, you can send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com or you can subscribe to this channel and you'll receive an update or an email every time one of these updates comes out. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes U.S. Common Core standards. This week, the core team, which includes the Pioneer and Satellite members, plus those helping who don't wish to be individually acknowledged, Finish the complete yellow ring of the technology and innovation molecule graphic, which you can see here. This brings us to 40% complete with this image. Behind the scenes, we also finished brainstorming the bullet points for the technology and innovation sections of green, yellow, and about 50% of violet. This is on the technology and innovation half of the molecule. In addition to this, we finished the first 50% of the human body themed lesson plan web page. You can see this here, showing the first half of the associated lesson plans that teach all subjects to any learning level and any learning environment using the central theme of the human body. Behind the scenes, we finish the next 45% of the next lesson plan we're working on with the central theme of civilization. This brings us to about 55% complete with that lesson plan. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined, and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food researched and added two resources sections to the open source melons hub, the open source parsnips hub, and the open source parsley hub. In addition to this and behind the scenes Sandra Solani, vegan chef and author of What's Your QB, outlined the first draft you can see here of five weeks of the menus she is designing for the food cell sufficiency transition plan. This transition plan is also part of the upcoming crowdfunding campaign and you can see the first three of these menus or meals rather already on the page. In this area of our open source project we are seeking permaculturalists, an irrigation specialist, a surveyor, and a chef to join our team as either consultants to the project or pioneers who will be moving onto the property with us. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week the core team working on highest good housing created the Cobb Village Open Source Hub featuring the beautiful concept designs of architect and watercolor artist Douglas Sims Stenhouse. You can see this new page and all of Doug's amazing designs here. We also updated the Highest Good Housing Hub overview image and description for the Cobb Village section. 
For the Earthbag Village, we continued laying out the specifics for the open source Murphy Bed Furniture assembly details behind the scenes. This included cutting lumber and labeling pieces for the under loft top, and assembling the top under loft part and attaching it to the frame. What you see here is all this behind the scenes work in progress, and we estimate we're now 40% complete with what is needed for the website. Also behind the scenes, we finished another 30% of the earth dome window and door framing reformatting details needed before moving these specifics to the website. This brings us to 75% complete with this work. We additionally updated all the images on the crowdfunding campaign overview page, and you can see these updates here, including the header, bathroom designs, and Murphy bed design images in both 3D and CAD. In addition to this, we started moving the amazing work and calculation details from Samuel Soroster, permaculturist and sustainable designer from Green New World, onto the Eco Bathroom and Shower Open Source Hub. You can see these new details here that we'd say encompass about 10% of the immense body of work and detail Samuel has completed over the past couple of months working on this. More to come later. Dave Wallen, architectural drafter and designer and owner of Dave Philip Wallen Design, also completed these additions to the Straw Bale Village Pod 2 central social space design that includes adjustments to layouts, increased use of straw bales for this part of the construction, and a new roof design. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team updated the open source pool and spa page with all the additional details here from Jennifer Engelmeyer. Eco Pool and Spa Specialist and founder of LoveYourNaturalPool.com, and Rick Ruggles, Swimming Pool Equipment and Health Consultant with Hayward Pool Products. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week, the core team created new social media imagery and updated and featured our communication page that teaches how we use this value in our decision-making process and global change approach. We also did this for our Dreams lesson plan page that provides a structure for teaching all subjects to all learning levels in any environment using the central theme of dreams. And we did this for our Sovereignism page that discusses our idea of a political and social structure designed to encourage and support the self-creation and sustainability of liberty and freedom for all people individually, governmentally, economically, and culturally. In addition to these, we also added the list you see here to the page we're developing to promote Sue. This list features forward thinking and progressive pages we've run across on Sue, our favorite new social media network. And last but not least, we updated our consensus page to include a two-step provision addressing the possibility when a very small minority, less than 10%, may choose to block the much larger consensus of the group. Read the page to see how we did this while maintaining our commitment to full consensus and the complete consensus process. In this area of the project, we're seeking graphic designers, web designers, and technology specialists, videographers, and building a highest good legal team. If you or someone you know fits these descriptions and would like to join our highest good society creation process. Every week, one community is reporting on our progress, creating the open source foundations for a sustainable civilization. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, economics, which is for-profit and non-profit business creation, education, fulfilled living, and true earth stewardship. We're putting all of these elements and components together to create a complete model, a solution model that creates additional solution creating models in the form of teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs to be built around the world.
forming a global collaborative and cooperative working together for the highest good of all of humanity. The idea of putting all these things together is widespread and lasting living style reform. What this means is we want to create a new way of living that takes and combines sustainable physical infrastructure and combines that with sustainable emotional and psychological infrastructure. Ultimately combining the food, energy, and housing with the fulfilled living models, the education model, the true earth stewardship, the highest good economics, putting these together to create a truly sustainable living environment that most people will consider to be far superior to the way that they are living right now. And by making this open source and free sharing all these tools, tutorials, resources, the blueprints, and creating a tangible, physical environment that people can come and experience and decide if it's something that they want to duplicate, this is how we see the model spreading. We know that if we make it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough, the idea of widespread and lasting living style reform will spread on its own. And this is what we're focused on. We believe that if the, if the goal is to truly transform this planet and make it a better place for everyone, to improve the quality and the standard of living for all people, all life on this planet, then it has to be a model that's going to spread on its own. And that's why we're bringing together people with the consciousness for the highest good of all. We're bringing together people that believe that that is possible, that believe that this is a worthwhile adventure and something worth doing to create that to make it as easy as, as necessary, to make it as affordable as necessary, and then to build the living example so that people can come and experience it and make a decision for themselves. And designing it all open source so if people want to do it differently, if people want to do it better, if people want to do it something, create a different iteration of what it is that we're doing, then that is as easy as possible so that we can create an ever-growing and expanding suite of open source and free shared solutions for other people to modify and adapt even farther, farther than that. In this way, we can change the way that people live, living style reform, and make it widespread. So if this sounds interesting to you, if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds like a worthwhile, noble adventure, we invite you to join us. We have lots of different ways to do that, from the pioneers that will move onto the property and build everything that is one community, to satellite members operating and working with us behind the scenes and part of the core team, to partners and consultants, or just sharing our information online is also a huge help. We are on all of the different social media networks, our favorite being Sue, the newest social media network that we are developing, but we are also on Twitter, we are on Pinterest, we are on Facebook, we are on LinkedIn, we are on Reddit, we are on Tumblr, and we are on about 10, 15 other social media networks as well to make it as easy as possible for people to access and share the information that we're creating so that it gets in the hands of the people who need it most. And of course, the number one thing that we are hoping for, that we are working on right now, people ask us all the time, what is the number one thing that people can do to help support one community? We're looking for that large-scale funding. And so sharing our information is what's necessary to get our project in the hands of the person or organization that would want to either donate to our 501c3 nonprofit organization or uh, invest in our organization, help us get the property off the market so that we can get boots on the ground and take our entire creative and open source sharing process to the next level, multiplying everything that we're doing realistically a hundredfold and beyond as we build our team faster, as we're able to work more effectively in a group together in real space versus collaborating globally the way that we are right now in virtual space and progressing everything to the level that's really capable of being progressed to. So with that, I want to say thank you for following our progress. As always, if you'd like to receive a weekly update every time one of these uh, videos comes out, every time we do a weekly update, if you'd like to receive an email, you can send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you to everybody who sends us emails. Thank you to everybody who for the small, small donations that we get and for following our progress. And until next week, we will, of course, keep on keeping on. Thank you.